owner of a local business is using his experience as a distiller to give back to the community during this stressful time. News 13 Stephanie Chavez has the story. Broken Trail Distillery and Brewery looks like a normal tap room. Bottles of their craft vodka line the shelves, and a list of unique cocktails on a chalkboard hangs above the bar. Since Thursday, the owners of the bar have added a new kind of cocktail. So we decided that with our uh, expertise and our materials and ingredients that we would uh, start compounding our own hand sanitizer. Matt Simons, the owner of Broken Trail, says he was frustrated by some of the price gouging he's been seeing on sanitation products since the COVID-19 outbreak. We had somebody report that it was on sale on eBay for hundreds of dollars. So he's taking matters into his own hands. He's made at least 1,000 two ounce bottles of hand sanitizer using some of the ingredients they already have to distill their vodka. By nature of our business, we have large quantities of ethanol present. And like I just mentioned, we also have the ability to take measurements and verify the purity of, of what it is we're making. He says some of the necessary ingredients in a recipe created by the World Health Organization. Organization have been hard to find. And he says since the virus has made its way to New Mexico, business has been slow. We have seen a downtick in sales. But he says he still plans to continue making the hand sanitizer for the community. And it's not about fighting, it's not about hoarding, um, it's about sharing and looking out for each other. Stephanie Chavez, KRQE News 13. The, the distillery near Manal and San Pedro is giving away the bottles of hand sanitizer for free. They say you just have to go in and ask one of the staff members for it. Of course, we'll continue.